to bike or run along the lakefront, you may soon be able to extend your workout for 58 miles. CBS 2's Ed Curran live in Whiting, Indiana tonight with the Mobile Weather Lab. Hi, Ed. They've talked for a decade now about expanding the path along the lake here all the way from southeast Chicago to southwest Michigan. And this week, once again, they'll be applying for funds to help pave the way. It's called the Marquette Greenway and will take you eventually on a scenic trip around the southern tip of Lake Michigan. It takes you right from uh, the south side of Chicago, Calumet Park, winds you right through the heart of northwest Indiana, through the Indiana Dunes National Lakeshore, eventually in the southwest Michigan Harbor Country. We spoke on a great bike path in Whiting, Indiana, part of 28 existing miles of paved paths. Linking segments like these will take federal funds. We're looking for $23 million to finish those uh, 30 remaining miles. An asphalt bike highway from Chicago to New Buffalo, Michigan. Trails have proven to be economic generators where they have been placed. Property values go up, quality of life improves. And a path like this connects a diverse population to the renowned Indiana Dunes National Lakeshore. They'll find out late this year if the funds have been approved. As this front comes through here, we've seen the winds shift off of Lake Michigan here at beautiful Whiting Beach. And we went from the upper 80s down to about 85 degrees in the last 10 minutes with a nice breeze out of the north now. At uh, Wahala Beach, Ed Curran, CBS 2 News. Rob and Erica? Yeah, things finally getting comfortable out there. Ed, thank you.